You are listening to the Daily Gospel Reflections with Sister Cloth. This podcast is brought to you by the Pauline's Multimedia. It is our mission to bring the Word of God to all peoples through sounds and images, voices, and music. Come and join us as we share with you a thought a day. Our reading is taken from the Gospel account of St. Matthew, chapter 13, verses 1 to 9. On that day, Jesus went out of the house and sat down by the sea. Such large crowds gathered around him that he got into a boat and sat down, and the whole crowd stood along the shore. And he spoke to them at length in parables, saying, A sower went out to sow, and as he sowed, some seed fell on the path, and birds came and ate it up. Some fell on rocky ground, where it had little soil. It sprang up at once because the soil was not deep, and when the sun rose, it was scorched, and it withered for lack of roots. Some seed fell among thorns, and the thorns grew up and choked it. But some seed fell on red soil and produced fruit a hundred or sixty or thirtyfold. Whoever has ears ought to hear. Welcome back. We are celebrating a special feast today. The Roman Catholic Church commemorates the parents of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Saints Joachim and Anne. We know very little about these two holy people, but taking into account the life of our Blessed Mother, it is easy to conclude that Saints Joachim and Anne must have lived a remarkable life here on earth. As parents of an exceptional daughter, this saintly couple must have played a vital role in the spiritual formation of Mary, whom God has chosen to be the mother of His only begotten Son, Jesus. Reflecting on today's parable of the sower, I can imagine how the seed of God's grace fell on the rich soil of Saints Joachim and Anne's hearts. This holy couple must have nurtured and cared for the seeds God had sown in their hearts. At the right time, the seeds produced an extraordinary fruit that is most admirable and pleasing in the eyes of God, the Blessed Virgin Mary. A creeping temptation to pessimism might dampen our spirits, knowing that we are far behind the holiness of Saints Joachim and Anne. However, it is not too late to catch up with them. We may not be on par with them, even if we try our best to work it out. But I believe that with God's grace and goodwill, the seed that falls on our rocky soil might become fertile ground one day. We only need to smash and crush the rocky parts in us. Lord Jesus, because your saving will is eternal, We believe you do not give up on anyone or any person as hopelessly lost. Please help us to be constant in our resolve to be better persons and always open and willing to give our best. Amen. Be with us again tomorrow as we share with you a thought a day. Meanwhile, you can follow us and listen to other Apple and Google podcasts on Spotify, produced by Pauline's Multimedia. Have a good day.